Hey guys, uh, score up 316. And I don't want to keep you guys or anything or surprise you guys, but I, I'm, I'm sure you heard of that stuff like in Roswell, New Mexico, like where they see UFOs carrying Elvis Presley or something like that. And then, well, I don't want to surprise you guys. Like I didn't see a UFO or anything. I haven't been to uh, the border yet. <laughs> you see what I did there? <laughs> okay. Well, but I didn't. Well, I didn't see any UFOs. I did get some messages on my answering machine that concern me. They're from a bunch of aliens. So you can hear. I don't know if you can hear it beeping right now, but I can hear my answering machine beeping, telling me I have some messages, and I'm going to share it with you guys before I contact SETI about it. So let's go on a magical journey. Well, this is my answering machine right here. And, uh, I got eight messages, which is weird because I remember a few years ago when I was younger, I was with a friend, we sent messages to my house phone and we had eight of them, but I digress. So, let's listen to these things. Eight new messages. Uh, what's up, Earth? It's your friend, uh, from Neptune. Uh, the year is four. And I, uh, just want to tell you guys that, uh, yeah, in a few, uh, thousand years, there's this thing called Pokemon that's going to be really popular. Make sure you take advantage of it. Things are going to be cool. I want to that, guys. Oh, there's more. Saturday, 7.49 p.m. Hey, it's Neptune again. Congratulations on, uh, inventing the wheel. Discovering dinosaurs and discovering fire. Who knows? Anyway, so we are thirteen forty eight and um yeah, in a few months we're gonna be sending some of the disease drafts to you. And uh I just wanna see you guys run around like a bunch of losers because you don't have soap yet. And if you do, you're rich. And it's made out of like elephant stuff or whatever. Anyways, um so yeah, all you have to do is wash yourself. But, uh, if you don't, then you're just like every other human being. Um, yeah, so don't mind the rats. They're friendly. I'll let you go near them. In that case, they're going to be disease. Yeah, so, uh, have fun. It was right. Better go watch the first company. Peace. There's another one. Saturday, 7.53 p.m. Hola, señor. Me llamo Francesco. Yo tengo un gato y como usted perro y pienso offer es el café de merda. Adiós. See? An alien. Here's another one. Saturday, 7.56 p.m. Hey, it's Neptune again. Um, just wanted to say that, uh, we intercepted a telegram from, uh, from, uh, Mars. Apparently they're uh, hiring a Russian spy by the name of Francis Scott Key. She's doing pretty cool stuff up. And apparently he's doing a lot of fun about it. So, yeah. Russia Patrol. Okay, later. 3companies.com. Saturday, 7.57 p.m. Hello, Neptune. Hey, Neptune. Hey, Neptune. Hey, Neptune. Hey, Neptune. Hey, Neptune. Hey, it's Neptune again. Sorry this message is a few years late. We got held up in Japan. Um... Anyway, so yeah, now that you guys got, uh, TVs, yeah, I don't know if you've noticed, the Freeze Company isn't on the air anymore, so you're gonna have to, uh, like, watch another show, like House, or a really useless movie, like The Blind Side. Um, you just to tell yeah, so, uh, oh, and don't forget, uh, drugs are illegal, but it doesn't mean they're not fun. Okay, peace out. I think one of these is a YouTube 7, comment, too. 7, 50, 9, hey, nice videos! First! <laughs> See?
my descendants deal with that. I don't care. <laughs> well, that's it. I uh, just want to show you those messages before I send them to SETI. So, like, I wish I could stay longer, but I actually got some stuff I need to take care of. So, uh, see you guys later. Come on. One pair. Just one. And I'll leave you alone.